Champions Conference semifinals are about to kick off. On court one, Dasimo Rush versus the Borp Crushers for Power Soccer Shop. I'm Tony Jackson, and these two teams will play for a chance to go to the championship later on today on court two, the Ball State Cardinals and the PRHC Chariots. Both these teams also looking for their ticket to the championship match. We'll bring you updates on scores as they happen. And we have one more match, the knockout round robin for the Champions Conference. The final match in that one, Atlanta Sting versus Boston Breakers. Here on this court, quick rundown of the lineups. In goal for the Buck Crushers, number 88, Jake Bath on the far side of the floor. Number five, Callum Kane in the middle. Number 91, John Madigan. And here on our near side, number 30, Josh Berger. For Dasima Rush in goal, number 14, Sarah Schwagel. On the far side of the floor, number one, Connor Walsh. In the middle, number five, Brady Kedge. And here on our near side, number 22, Tyler King. There's the whistle, and we are underway. Semi-final round of the Champions Conference. One of these teams will play in the final and earn promotion to the Premier Conference. The other one will play for third place. Walsh over to King. King late on the cross. He goes out for a goal kick. Bath sends the ball down the floor and out of play. And that really just a strategic move to push the other team back. They were defending pretty tightly, so Bath just uh, took the option that he saw. Give and go between King and Kedge. Oh, and heavy contact. Going to have a kick in now for Dasima Rush. Kedge now moving down. King going to send the ball his way. King to Kedge. Kedge misses that ball. Walsh is there. That ball sent out of play off of Bath. And another kick in for Dasima Rush. Now there is a gap behind Jake Bath. Walsh gonna take that shot off of Madigan, but it hits the post. Oh, the referee's pointing towards the corner. Let's see here. A little brief discussion says it's going to be a goal kick. This goal kick brought to you by MK Battery. That ball off the back of Kane's chair is going to go out now for a corner kick. This corner kick brought to you by Biojet. Brady Kedge on the kick for Dasima Rush. Tyler King at the far post. Walsh at the near post. That ball off of Kane. Close to a two-on-one violation. But Madigan drives the ball out of the area. And the referee is going to call it now. We're going to bring the ball back. John Madigan did not hear the whistle below. He kept going. Now we will return the ball to the Bork goal area. Now Dasimo Rush actually going to have an indirect free kick. Walsh over to King. King with a shot. He sliced it right between the defenders and scores a goal. Wonderful shot by Tyler King. He saw the opening and he took it. 1-0 Dasimo Rush. You'll see it once again. Great shot here by Tyler King. Wonderful angle taken on that ball. Kedge, Bath, coming up in an attacking role. Oh 
Madigan trying to drag Brady Kedge. Nicely done, Kedge. Madigan just hits it out to prevent Dasimo Rush from moving further up the floor. Kedge goes around Madigan. Kedge has King, but he decides to take it himself. Trying to move Jake Bath back towards the goal area. Kedge wins the battle against Bath, but Bath recovers quite well. And now Bath pushing the ball out of the area. A ball out of play, another kick in for the Book Crushers. Update on court three. The battle for survival. Atlanta Sting draws first blood. It's 1-0. The winner of that match will stay up in the Champions Conference and the loser will go down. Kedge looking to pass. Kane is there. Kane, that's a three in the box violation. But the official is going to call a corner kick. Kane, Madigan, and Bath. All in the goal area. And the three in the box violation is going to get called. So Tyler King is going to set up at the near post. Brady Kedge going to take the kick. Connor Walsh at the far post. Kedge going right to King. King deflects the ball. Madigan punches it in. John Madigan. Hits the ball over the goal line. I don't know if that's going to be ruled an own goal, but this was well executed by Dasimo Rush. And you can see John Madigan right there just knocked the ball in. Dasimo Rush in the sixth minute, up 2-0. Berger tries to take on Tyler King, and now he moves the ball down the floor. Josh Berger, Tyler King doing battle. Berger releases, or excuse me, King releases. Berger circles around the ball. The pass, Bath, across catch. Kane with a shot. Kane saved by Schwagel. Now everybody waiting, not wanting to hit the ball out. Brady Catch does very well. That is going to be a kick in for Dasimo Rush. Wonderful play by Sarah Schwagel. Kedge now driving Madigan out of the area. Kedge looking to get around Bath. He goes to Walsh. Walsh pushes down the floor. Callum Kane is there to cut him off. Kane now just using that size to drive Walsh around. Ball still in play, and now it's out in favor of Bort. Kane, soft kick, taken by Kedge. No one in the goal area right now, but great. Jake Bath managed to get that ball. Sarah Schwagel, Jake Bath, the two keepers doing battle. It's going to go out in favor of the Borp, Borp Crushers. Berger to Bath, Kedge, Berger lets it roll out. Another kick in. Give and go between Berger and Bath. Bath, Kedge, Kedge trying to get it down the floor. That's close to a two on one, actually a three on one. Bath, Kane, and Berger all converging on Brady Kedge. Kedge looking for his options. Walsh is there. Nicely done, Connor Walsh, to take that ball. Now Kedge, nicely done, Brady Kedge again. Bath with the ball, Walsh now kicks across. Kedge, Kedge splits the defenders, Josh Berger, great save. Let's see if we can check that one out again. You see Josh Berger here, Brady Kedge takes a shot. Josh Berger almost lets that ball go through, but nicely done. And now Brady Kedge setting up. 
to take the kick. Kedge. Jake Bath is there. Oh, and that ball just wide of the post. Madigan had left the post. I think if it were on target, he would have gotten there in time. Still dangerous moment, though, for the Borp defense. Jake Bath taking the kick. Tyler King's right there. Deflects it back. Bath. That ball across. Kane looks for a spin kick. Doesn't get it. Walsh now looking to take a shot. He does. It's off of Kane and another kick in. Dasimo Rush have been smothering the Borp defense early in this match. Tenth minute. Walsh going to take the kick. Bath is there. Stack defense for Borp. Kedge tries to split the defenders. Now Kedge has the ball. Madigan hits it off of Kedge. It goes out for a kick in. And if you're Borp, this is the worst place you can be to try to kick the ball out of your area. You are as deep as you can be. Kedge with the ball against Bath. Brady Kedge loses the ball. Jake Bath nicely done. Connor Walsh is there to take on Bath, but Bath is just dragging him down. Walsh turning him around a little bit. Bath stopped by Walsh. Berger's there to wait for the pass. Kedge is there also waiting for a pass to come out. Bath is there. He's got it. Now Bath moving down the floor. Kedge is there. He misses the kick-out pass. It's going to be an MK Battery goal kick for Dasimo Rush. In the other semifinal match, we're still scoreless. 12th minute. Ball State Cardinals and PRHC Chariots. Walsh. That should be a foul, but it's going to be a kick in, it looks like, for Borb. Bath taking on Kedge. That ball stripped away. Madigan looking for a spin kick, and he gets it. Schwagel there for a save. Great shot by Madigan. Great save by Schwagel. Jake Bath going to take this kick. Callum Kane at the near post. Madigan at the far post. Oh, and Bath tried to split the defenders. And now Berger right there to stop the ball from going any further. Brady Kedge trying to drag Josh Berger. Ball out of play now. Kick in. Dasimo Rush. King. Kedge. Kedge turning Madigan. Ball in play. Kedge, no options to pass. There's Tyler King. That's close to a two on one violation. But Dasimo Rush will get the kick in. Tyler King going to take this kick. Brady Kedge sliding down into an open space. Connor Walsh at the top of the goal area. King. Kedge, Kedge, right into the defense. King into Berger. There's a foul. Oh, and Josh Berger called for the foul there. Let's go back here and see that, that nice save by Josh Berger earlier in the match. And now we're back to live action here. Brady Kedge going to take the shot. Tyler King waiting for it. Jake Bath ready to defend. Kedge right into Kane, but he hits it into the area. Walsh takes a shot. Kedge saved by Bath. Walsh to Kedge. He tried to redirect it, but Bath is there. Now Jake Bath has got leverage. We're going to get a two-on-one violation on Dasimo Rush. Directing traffic here. Bath, give and go. Kedge looking to attack it. Nicely done by Kane. 
Kedge turns around and recovers well, but Kane is trying to turn Brady Kedge. Kane's ripping that ball violently. It's going to be a kick in for the Borg Crushers. Berger. Oh, Madigan gets it across. Kane with a shot. Score! Callum Kane with a goal. Wonderful shot by Callum Kane. Perfectly executed play. Berger gets it right over to Madigan, who gets it past Kedge and Callum Kane with the 180 spin kick. So now the score 2 1. We are moving into the 16th minute of the match. Walsh going around Berger. Josh Berger, Jake Bath, nice pass. Kedge with a shot. Oh, he tried to go for it. The ball a little too close. Miles Schaefer into the match for it. Dasimo rush. Walsh cut off by Berger. Now pass Madigan going across to Kane, but that ball too far out. Now, Miles Schaefer was the last to touch it. He goes out of play for a kick in. Or crushers. Schaefer gets it over to Kedge. Kedge, the cross is going to get cut off by Berger. Kedge gets behind Berger. Nicely done, Brady Kedge to turn Josh Berger. Now Josh Berger just pushing that ball down the floor. Kedge looking for Walsh. Kedge looking to drive. Kedge right there looking to push through. Brady Kedge, ball now pushed out of play. And a Biogen corner kick for Dasimo Rush. Update on court three, Atlanta Sting lead 2-0 over the Boston Breakers. And on court two, PRHC Chariots and Ball State Cardinals are still scoreless. Kedge, Walsh, Walsh with a 180 spin kick off of Madigan. My goodness, that ball went flying in the air. Connor Walsh was winding up for a 180 spin kick. And John Madigan came up and that ball went right into the stands, ladies and gentlemen. So we're going to have a set ball. Jake Bath, Connor Walsh. Now Bath is currently out of the goal area, so Madigan cannot come out to help until Bath gets back into the area. Otherwise, it will be a two-on-one violation. Walsh, the kick out. He didn't get anything on it, but Brady Kedge is there. Not a good angle for Kedge, though. It's out for a kick in in favor of the Warp Crushers. 18th minute of the match over here. 2-1 the score in favor of Dasimo Rush. Bath taking the ball. Brady Kedge getting dragged. That ball last touched off of Kedge. And the scoring opportunity here for the Crushers. Can they equalize? Jake Bath going to take the kick. We'll have our answer in a moment. Callum Kane with a shot. Schwegel with a clearance. Bath with a shot. Schwegel with another save. Nice clearance by Kedge. Berger looking for an open space. Bath going to take the ball over to Kane. Kedge cuts it off. Kane, Kedge. Madigan pushes Kedge. I think Madigan was the last to touch that ball. That time he was, certainly. Kick in for Dasimo Rush. 19th minute. Madigan jumped that ball nicely. It's going to go out for a goal kick. Dasimo Rush getting pushed back. This goal kick brought to you by MK Battery. Madigan within five meters, so referee 
Chris Mahalan asking him to move back a little bit. Kedge passes to Walsh. And that ball's going out for another goal kick. We're in out of time here. The score 2 1 in favor of Dasima Rush. The other semifinal match also went out of time. They are still scoreless. Madigan with the ball. Sends it out of play. It's going to be a kick in for Borp. Bath. Oh, that ball gets to Madigan. Schwegel with a save. Very close. Sarah Schwegel, though, right there to save it. Jake Bath taking the kick. Schwegel with a save. Bath with another kick. Schwegel with another save. Kedge. Bath trying to drag Kedge, but Brady Kedge very strong. Now Jake Bath gets the ball back. Kedge circles back to defend. Nice clearance. Now Schaefer comes up, but Berger gets the ball for Borp. Kedge driving the ball back the other way. Madigan comes up to defend. That ball out, and that is the halftime whistle, ladies and gentlemen. Dasimo Rush scored two early goals. The Borp Crushers come back and get one of their own. We're going to take a break. We'll bring you the second half. The winner going to the final. You're watching the Champions Conference semifinal here at the 2018 USPSA MK Battery Conference Cup Series.
Orp Crushers, Dasimo Rush. One of these teams will head on to the final. If the score remains the same, it will be Dasimo Rush. But the Orp Crushers have other ideas. For Power Soccer Shop, I'm Tony Jackson. We're getting ready to start the second half of this Champions Conference semifinal match. One quick change to the lineups for Dasimo Rush. Miles Schaefer is on the floor in place of Tyler King. In the other games, they are already underway through the second half in the 26th minute. The Ball State Cardinals lead the PRHC Chariots 1-0. And also in the 26th minute, the Atlanta Sting have increased their lead to three. There's now 3-0 Sting over the Breakers. Free kick for Dasimo Rush. Kedge goes over to Schaefer. Kane, the pass back to Kedge. Now back to Schaefer. And he was a little bit late on that. Last touching off of Bath, and it'll be a kick in for Dasimo Rush. Kedge back to Schaefer, close to a two on one violation. Kedge taking on Kane. That ball out of play, more crushers with a kick in. Kane going to take the kick. Kane, catch, cuts that off very well. Schaefer wasn't quite sure what to do with it. Now Berger takes the ball. That ball bounces back. That's close to a two-on-one violation. Madigan sends the ball across. No one there to collect it. Kick in. Dasimo rush. Schaefer to catch. Catch back to Schaefer. Nice give and go, but Kane gets there first. Kedge cuts it off, prevents Berger from getting the ball. Bath. Bath gets around Kedge. Now Walsh has to come in to defend. The kick out. Madigan. Madigan goes back to Bath. Bath. Kedge there cuts it off. Madigan. That's close to a two on one violation. Jake Bath is out of the goal area. to Walsh. Madigan was there to cut it off. Now that was close to five meters, but I think Madigan was just right there at the edge. Walsh, Madigan with a 180 spin kick, allows Dasimo Rush to move up the floor just a little bit. Madigan, Kedge holds that ball in play. Madigan, Kedge, nicely done, Brady Kedge. Still has the ball now, the Kedge. Trying to turn Josh Berger. Kedge, nicely done, good recovery by Berger. Now Kane has the ball off of Kedge. Bath tries to pass, Berger's there to collect it. Kedge, that ball going across to Schaefer. Madigan's going to cut it off. Bath is back in the goal area. Kedge has the ball. That's close to a two-on-one violation. Play continues, though. Jake Bath was definitely out of the area. Now Josh Berger setting up in the middle of the floor. Kedge having a discussion with the referee. Rupert Callum Kane going to take the kick. 
We're going to get a substitution, though. Miles Schaefer coming off. Tyler King coming back on. Bath. All four board players up the floor right now. Callum Kane, the most back player. Another kick in for Bort. All four Bort players are up in an attacking position. Can Dasimo Rush take advantage of this? Kedge, Bath, Kedge, Kane, Kane back to Bath. Bath trying to go back to Kane. Kane gets it through. Schwegel has to make a save on it. Kedge just hits it out for a Borp kick in. Dangerous moments there for Dasimo Rush. Borp trying to equalize. Jake Bath going to take the kick. Callum Kane with the shot, saved by Schwegel. Bath into Kedge. Bath, the last to touch that kick in. Dasimo Rush. 27th minute, Dasimo Rush, two early goals. Still enough to hold the lead for now, but Borb are pressing. On the other court, 32nd minute, Ball State Cardinals still lead 1-0. And on court three, Atlanta Sting, 32nd minute, leading 3-0. Give and go between Kedge and King. Nice pass by Callum Kane. Brady Kedge right there very alertly cuts that ball off. Kedge tries to get a ball, the ball away from Berger. Close to two on one. Callum Kane couldn't get out of the way in time. So we're going to get another kick in. Or excuse me, this is going to be a free kick for Dasimo Rush. Kedge going to Tyler King. That was well executed by Dasimo Rush. Kane sends the ball back down the floor. King, the last to touch it. Kane goes across to Berger. Berger, catch right there. Bath right there. Oh, no one in goal, but that ball is just wide. Now, Borp, in similar fashion to England, are playing four up, but they're playing a much more aggressive style with Bath constantly in the attacking position, leaving a lot of space back there. It requires so much coordination and court awareness and positioning to do that properly. Borp have done very well throughout the tournament with it. Hedge, Madigan, Berger on the run. Connor Walsh tracking back to defend. Walsh, that ball still in play. Nicely done, Connor Walsh. Berger just pushes it out. Smart move. Kick in, Dasimo Rush. Walsh tried to get that ball, but Berger's there. Kedge. Pushes the ball down the floor. Close to a two-on-one. That should be called. Play continues, though. Kick in. Dasimo Rush. Jake Bath was far out of the goal area. That should have been a two-on-one call. But now kick in. Dasimo Rush. Tyler King with the kick. Connor Walsh at the far post. Brady Kedge at the top of the goal area. Nicely done, Jake Bath. And 
now Kedge has to track back on defense. Josh Berger, one on one with Schwegel. Nicely done, Sarah Schwegel, such an experienced goalkeeper. She knew exactly what she was doing right there. Walsh hits it into Madigan. Madigan can't control the ball. King's going to take it. Callum Kane. Madigan. No one in the goal area except for Schwegel. Nicely cleared out by Schwegel. Now Kedge is in there. Kedge, Kane doing battle. Kane looking to pass it out. Well read by Kedge. Walsh looking to send the ball down the floor. Bath is there. Kedge now looking for a deflection. He misses the ball. That ball comes back out. Kedge. Kane doing battle. Walsh tries to save the ball. It's going to go out for a goal kick in favor of Borp. This goal kick brought to you by MK Battery. On court three, an update in the score, 37th minute. The Boston Breakers are on the board. 3-1 the score. Here we are in the 32nd minute. Decima Rush still with a one goal lead. Dasimo Rush. On court two, 37th minute. Ball State Cardinals clinging to a narrow 1-0 lead. Walsh hitting that ball the wrong way. Gives Borp an opportunity. They're trying to equalize. They've had a few chances, but they haven't been able to convert. Kane, Walsh, Kedge going to take the ball. Jake Bath there to defend. That ball out of play. It's going to go out for a kick in. I think Borp's going to get this one, but we'll wait for the official word. It is going to be a Borp kick in. Kedge trying to take on Bath. Bath turning Kedge. Kedge pushes it out. Kick in for Borp once again. Borp, desperate for that equalizer. Let's see if they can get it. And on court two, the PRHC Chariots have just equalized. It is the 38th minute of the match. High drama across the Plasma Athletic Center. Like Callum Kane having some trouble with his chair. So the assistant coach coming out. Callum Kane good to go again. Jake Bath taking the kick. Bath right into Kedge. Walsh clears out. Kedge, Bath. Great battles between these two throughout the match. Brady Kedge holds on to that ball. Can he keep it in play? Yes, he can. Wonderfully done, Brady Kedge. Now Madigan with the ball. King is there. Tyler King sends the ball up to Jake Bath. Bath sends that ball wide of the goal area. It's going to be a goal kick for Dasimo Rush. At a time on court two, they are level at one. If the score remains the same, they will go into overtime. At a time on court three, Atlanta Sting have put up another one. It's 4-1. It looks like the Boston Breakers will go down to the President's Conference. Dasima Rush clinging to that narrow lead. The score 2-1 here. We're in the 35th minute. Kedge. Kane just pushes through Kedge. Schwagel there. Kedge pushes it out. 
in a Biogen corner kick for the Borp Crushers. Bath, Kane, saved by Kedge. Callum Kane is just using his size advantage to drag the Dasimo rush players around. Let's see, the call is going to go in favor of Borp. So another kick in for them, 36th minute. Jake Bath with a kick. Brady catch nicely done. Berger, oh, Berger misses the ball. Catch now with an opportunity to move down the floor. But Berger, to his credit, does very well to recover. That could have been fatal for Borp as they try to mount a comeback. And ladies and gentlemen, it looks like the semifinal match between the Ball State Cardinals and the PRHC Chariots is going into extra time. Kedge, Berger, close to another two on one. Walsh, too late on the swing, goes out for a kick in. Borp pinned deep in their own end. We're approaching the 37th minute. Josh Berger gonna take the kick, and Dasimo Rush are bearing down on Borp. This is exactly where they wanna keep them. Bath now with the ball. Jake Bath driving out. Kedge is trying to turn him away, prevent him from progressing any further. It's going to be another kick in for Borp. Can they score? before time runs out. Bath looking to pass. Nicely done by Kedge to cut it off. Kedge tries to get that ball and he can't do it, but it is Dasa Ball. Walsh, that ball gets all the way through to Bath. Now Madigan and Kane both there. Josh Berger. Oh, Connor Walsh misses the ball. Sarah Schwagel, Berger one-on-one. -on -one. Nicely done, Sarah Schwagel. Fantastic defense as Josh Berger saw that opportunity to score a goal and equalize. Again, Sarah Schwagel extremely experienced. Oh, and that ball off the back of Connor Walsh's chair. Not what you want if you're Dasimo Rush. On court two, they are getting ready to start extra time. Bath, cut off by Kedge. Burgers there. Jake Bath drops back to defend. Kedge beats Berger, but Berger, again, does very well to recover. Berger's got the ball, I think he was the last to touch it. Now Kedge, that ball rolling out, that's going to be a... It looks like the referees are signaling a corner kick, but it looked like Kedge was the last to touch that ball. Connor Walsh gonna take the kick. John Madigan, Jake Bath defending. Tyler King at the far post. Madigan with the ball, Kedge almost gets it. Kedge is turning Madigan away. That ball out. Kick in, Dasimo Rush. 40th minute approaching. We are about to go into added time here. Dasimo Rush holding on. Kane, Kedge gets that ball away from Kane. Berger's there. Oh, and there is a foul on Josh Berger. This is going to be a direct free kick for Dasimo Rush. Brady Kedge knocked around a little bit. It's out of time here. Again, Dasimo Rush, two, Borp Crushers, one. That ball off of Callum Kane, and he tries to spin to send it down the floor. Another kick in for Decimo Rush. 
Hunter Walsh goes directly on goal. Madigan almost lets it through. And that would have been the nail in the coffin. And there's a cross. Tyler King now. Tyler King with a shot. Saved by Jake Bath. Walsh looking to pass across again. Cut off by Jake Bath. Brady Kedge there. Kedge. Bath doing battle. That ball out of play. Referee says it's going to be Bork Ball. Bath, Kedge, Kedge wins the battle against Bath, King there, and there's the final whistle, Dasimo Rush, scored too early, and hold on for the victory, Borp Crushers mounting a furious comeback, but it wasn't enough, the final score, 2-1, Dasimo Rush have punched their ticket to the final, and they also earn promotion back to the Premier Conference. The other game on court two still taking place, that in extra time. If you want to watch that match, switch over to channel two, Power Shock Soccer Shop live stream. We're going to take a break. When we come back, more Power Soccer action. You're watching the 2018 USPSA MK Battery Conference Cup Series.